In this video, we're going to see how to open closed eyes with Photoshop Elements 2018. We'll see how to go from this to this. Hi, I'm Rick from EssentialPhotoshopElements.com. Let's go over to Elements and get started. I wanted to do this tutorial on how to open closed eyes, but I couldn't find a good photo to use. So I asked my wife Linda if she would pose with me where one of us would have our eyes closed. She agreed to help me out, so we set the timer on her camera and took three different shots. One where we both have our eyes open, and then another one where Linda has her eyes closed, and then this other one where I have my eyes closed. It's fairly common when taking a group shot that someone in the group gets caught on camera with their eyes closed. And the bigger the group, the better the chance of this happening. You can actually open closed eyes with Photoshop Elements 2018 using a new feature that was added to that version. Well, you actually still need a photo of that person with their eyes open, so it's always a good idea to snap a couple of different shots of the group. Let's dive in and see how it works. I have Photoshop Elements 2018 open, and let's start with the photo of Linda with her eyes closed. You don't have to, but I'm going to duplicate the background layer so we can go back to the original version if we need to. To do that, press Command-J on a Mac, or it would be Control-J on a PC. Now we have an exact duplicate of the background layer in the Layers panel, and it's named Layer 1 by default. Next, go up to the Enhance menu and choose Open Closed Eyes by clicking on it. The Open Closed Eyes dialog box appears. In the dialog box, there's a preview of your photo. Below the preview, there are a couple of zoom tools that you can use to zoom up and down with. Let's click a couple of times on the icon with the plus sign to zoom up to 100%. Elements puts a circle around every face that it detects in your photo. The person that will be affected has the circle highlighted in blue. In our example, the highlight happens to be around the person we want to open the eyes of, but if the person with the closed eyes has a gray circle around them, like I do here, so now Linda has the gray circle, you can just click on that person's face to highlight the circle. Over on the right side of the dialog box, you're instructed to open a source to use for replacing the eyes. There are three places to choose from. Your computer, the Photoshop Elements Organizer, or there are even four samples provided that you can choose from. In this example, my choice is obvious since I staged the photos to use in this tutorial. So I'll go up to my computer by clicking on it and then you can navigate to the photo that you want to use. I'll double click on the one where we both have our eyes open to choose it. And that's this one right here. Now you get a preview of any face from the photo that you chose. It says click to apply. So I'll do that. And the open eyes are applied to that photo. You can click on this button at the bottom of the window if you want to see the before and after. So there's before and there's after. And it did a pretty good job. If you're happy with the results, click the OK button to close the dialog box and apply the change. And that's really all there is to it. That wraps up this video on how to open closed eyes with Photoshop Elements 2018. It's a nice feature that works pretty well, but some of you might have older versions of Photoshop Elements. So next time, we'll see how to open eyes without Photoshop Elements 2018. Until then, this is Rick from EssentialPhotoshopElements.com saying take care. Now let's see, I think these eyes would look good on me. Perfect.